Thank you for choosing LiftMaster. LiftMaster's innovative gate operators are equipped with a diagnostic code display on the control board, which allows for expanded troubleshooting capabilities. This video will show you how to access and understand the diagnostic codes. This video is intended for demonstration purposes only. Please consult the manual for complete instructions and safety information. Fault conditions such as a gate that won't move due to a blocked photoelectric sensor result in a code showing up on the diagnostic code display. When you turn on the operator, the diagnostic code display will show SL or SW for a slide or swing operator, 12 or 24 for a 12 volt or 24 volt operator, and the firmware version. To view the history of diagnostic codes, press and hold the stop button. While holding the stop button, press and hold the close button. While holding the stop and close buttons, press and hold the open button. The two-digit diagnostic code display will show ER and then will flash, alternating between the two parts of the diagnostic code. The first part of the code is the sequence number. The operator is able to keep track of 20 diagnostic codes. The first code will display 01 for the sequence number, the second code 02, and so on. If more than 20 codes occur, the oldest codes will be overwritten. The second part of the code is the diagnostic code itself, which will be a number from 31 through 99. For the complete list of diagnostic codes and their meanings, refer to the owner's manual or wiring diagram. Some codes are saved in the diagnostic code history and some are not. If a code is not saved, it will only appear on the display as long as the fault condition exists and then automatically clear. For example, Code 72 can indicate an obstruction of the photo eye. This code is not saved when the fault condition is corrected. To scroll through the saved codes, press the close button to cycle to the oldest code. Press the open button to cycle to the most recent codes. To reset the diagnostic code history, press and hold the stop button for six seconds. The display will show ER then CL alternately for six seconds. Release the stop button. The diagnostic code history has now been reset. It is recommended to clear the history whenever you have serviced the operator. To exit the diagnostic code history, press the stop button. The diagnostic code history will also time out after two minutes of inactivity. For troubleshooting assistance using the diagnostic codes, Check out our other videos by clicking the info icon. Thank you for choosing LiftMaster. Visit liftmaster.com or the dealer extranet for more helpful information.